Well, folks, here we have it. We've got a Liberty engine that was built in August of 1918. Just bought this off of eBay. Came out of Northern California, courtesy of Tom West, up in Napa. It was in his collection. Uh, he bought it back in 1955 or so. Had it sitting in his barn since uh, the late 1960s when he relocated, and it's been sitting there probably for the last 50 plus years. So just got it out of there yesterday. Uh, had to go through and saw the backside of the barn out to get it out. It's kind of on a hillside, rather interesting extraction to say the least. The engine itself is in pretty decent shape. Uh, overall, it's complete. You know, the only thing that was really kind of questionable is there's no spark plug sitting in it. Near as I can tell, most of the cylinders look like they're going to be in pretty decent shape. The one on number 6L is going to have to come off, get it cleaned up. It's got a bit of rust in it. And we only have one stuck intake valve on number 6R, which you can see right there in the video there. Everything else seems to be there. Looked inside the crankcase through the bottom on the uh, oil, on the clean out for the screen. Don't see any major rust in there. Complete right on down to the Model A oil tank. Made from an old fuel tank from a Model A Ford. So pretty neat there. So we're going to go through and see if we can get her to make fire after we get this uh, cleaned up and get everything freed up on it. Amazingly, the distributors are even in time. Uh... They aren't too full of rust, which is just amazing. After sitting around for so many years, usually they're in pretty bad shape when I get them. So the plenum on it was all good. It was full of acorns and dirt and squirrel droppings. Got it kind of cleaned out. I'm going to go through and pull it out and make sure there's no big chunks of junk in there. That and all the uh, exhaust valves are uh, clean. They actually have nice nice oily carbon on them which kept them from getting stuck which is a good deal there on that so all in all I mean this is a barn fresh Liberty that hasn't seen the light of day for 50 plus years so in the next day or so we'll go through and uh, get her fired up and uh, see if she'll make some smoke for us I'm pretty sure she will so not much to them they're easy engines to work on but this is another one for my collection, so I got a pile of liberties now. Anyway, pretty cool stuff. So we'll go through and shoot another video here before not too long and uh, get that up there too so everybody can enjoy it. Anyway, thank you very much. Bye-bye.